you think? Good. Good. Morning, everybody. Happy Friday. It is Friday, June 9th, 2017. I'm headed into work for the day. I'm gonna go pick up some epic breakfast. So I'm thinking some Subway with a large Diet Coke. And uh, yeah. So the, uh, the Tool concert <clears throat> last night was phenomenal. Definitely worth the money. They had a laser show. They had really, really nice projection system. Um, projecting like their videos and images and stuff like that um, and uh, I just realized too just kind of how spot-on one of the uh, local tool cover bands is so I've been going to see them for years because actual tool hasn't been um, touring and uh, these guys do kind of the similar type of stuff as actual tool so it's pretty cool um, I'm beat so probably got home back to Vicky's maybe like 12:30 or 1. So I'm only going about six hours of sleep. Six hours sounds like a lot, but I was drinking um, whiskey and then beer. Uh, not feeling so good. So I am going to uh, just kind of see what's going on here. We've got a garage sale. All right, guys, what's happening? Just uh, getting out of work for lunch today. Headed over by Vicky's. I gotta pack up all my stuff to bring home after work. And uh, pack up Sophie's stuff, and we're gonna just probably make a sandwich or something. But, um, man, it was like two days ago, I was a little bit stressed out about my portfolio. I was like, oh man, I just cannot break like the 10K mark. And I figured, you know, all right, once I break the 10K mark, then it's it's gonna be crazy. It's just gonna go go from there. So I added in my other ICO. It's called Humanic, and I bought 20 28 dollars worth two months ago. Not even two months ago. It was about seven weeks ago, and it's worth 215 dollars. That's amazing. That's that's just awesome. So that's uh, I don't know. Is that uh, I think that's like an 8x return. That's freaking phenomenal. Swarm. So if you remember, Swarm was about four dollars and fifty cents per unit, and then it dipped. In the evening, it dipped down to like 380, and then it went back up the next day. But uh, now, today, right now, it's worth five dollars and forty-four cents. So that's over five thousand dollars on a hundred-dollar ICO initial buy-in. Amazing. So what I'm kind of realizing or feeling is that any ICO based off of like ether should net you some good gains so the base value should be whatever you invested in ether so if I spend a hundred dollars in ether it it'll it'll at least be worth that and that's most likely why we're seeing like an 8x ICO um, jump like almost immediately after purchase so ether is up um, ether is at $276 and I got 12.5 of those so that's 3500 bucks so my portfolio it just dipped down while I refreshed but it was at eleven thousand dollars today really waiting and hoping for some of my other investments to take off that kind of haven't so yeah just just phenomenal like I, I don't I don't even know how to explain it any any other way so almost a thousand dollar 24-hour increase in my portfolio which is 10% 
So obviously you go down as well. That's why I'm now working on diversifying. Cause like right now more than half of my portfolio is freaking swarm. I don't like that. So I don't know. I don't know what to do from here. I, I uh, as I mine more, my ether um, portion of my portfolio will go up. But it's taken like two weeks to mine one ether. Um, I think I still have another week before I can get um, another payout. But uh, that's gonna be almost 300 bucks. So that's that's phenomenal. I wish I had all my cards running right now. I'll tell you that much. But uh, last night one of my miners was overheating and shutting down. So I I have my thermal shut down set to 89 degrees Celsius so I changed that to 90 degrees Celsius and that seemed to keep it running um, now I don't know I, I guess I, I need to spend more time investing in partaking in ICOs um, I did buy in like a hundred hundred something dollars worth of BAT BAT and it's down a little bit I don't know. I think I bought in at 28 cents or something. It's like worth like 25 cents. Whatever. It's brand new. Like, shit. It's been on the, the Bittrex exchange for less than a week. Um, so I still kind of... I, I want to... I think I have like 400 and something bat. Let me think about that. Yeah, something like that. So, I don't know, I kind of like the idea of getting like a thousand of whatever. So, that way, you know, I can easily calculate, you know, how much profit I made or whatever. Um, if I have like a thousand, it's like a power of ten thing. I kind of kind of like that. But, um, this time next year, I'm, I'm feeling like I'm going to be in a good, good spot. So... Outside of the crypto world, I'm still working on paying off my credit cards. Um, we are almost done working on one of our clients, so I think that'll free up that cash. So I literally have a pile of cash from that job, just in case anything happens. So I think I'm going to dump that pile of cash onto my credit card and pay off maybe one of them. But uh, it feels good. It feels good to finally, you know, have my car up and running and solid and dependable and not be messing around and pouring more money into that and whatever. So, it's, uh, we're going to see what this next year brings now that I'm kind of learning more and more about ICOs and crypto in general and all that, what I like, what I don't like. Um, so, stay tuned for more. whoop de whoop what's going on everybody? Just getting out of work for the day and really excited to start the weekend. It doesn't even feel like Friday. I think like two days ago it felt like Friday. Uh, it's hot out. Car says 95 uh, and I'm over here wearing long sleeves. Now the uh, data center that I work in is pretty cold and uh, wasn't planning on working on the, in the hot aisle at all today so that's why I wear long sleeves versus short sleeves normally wear short sleeves um i did uh initial edits of all of Aid uh aiden's all of alden's photos from his uh senior photo shoot and uh went well so i'm excited about those uh there's somewhere around like 35 images or so um one steel wool uh, a few in a tunnel and uh I don't know, just a bunch of other ones and stuff, so it's uh, it's cool, it was fun, and you know, there's still some more editing that I want to do, but uh, I don't know, it's going to have to wait till next week, I'm thinking, I don't I don't know if I'm gonna even going to bring a computer uh, to the lake, we're going to the lake to see my parents tomorrow, just uh, for one night, it's going to be a short trip, but um it should be fun, so I, I want to get out there, maybe do some swimming, go on the on the ATVs, the four-wheelers. We'll see, it's going to be hot, like 
mega, mega, super crazy hot. So, um, maybe we'll go to the beach or something like that. But, uh, yeah, I gotta, um, I gotta start figuring out a schedule for when I can, like, sit down and seriously, like, block off time to study these ICOs and all that. Um, for a nearly instant, like, 10x return on picking the right ICO, I think it's worth, you know, sitting down. So, um, that one guy, he was talking about if you take your monthly expenses and divide it by 10 and place it on the 10 ICOs, all you need is like a few of them to pay off to make some really life changing money. Um, he's right. He's, he is right. I mean, Swarm is now over $5,000. It's like $5,500. That's half of my portfolio. And uh, even my other um, ICO is doing really well, too. So I, I, I understood the math when he was talking about it, but I didn't you know, quite believe it until I saw it. So, well, Swarm's, Swarm's over $5,000, and that was in a $100 original investment. What I'm figuring out is I think if I buy ICOs that are based off the Ether chain, um, it, typically the ICO, or that, that new coin, is going to be worth whatever you pay for it, um, minimum. Or I should say, like, however much Ether you buy in. So let's say I, I buy one Ether worth of an ICO, and Ether's worth 250 bucks. After the launch, it should be worth that much, the equivalent, or more. Um, rules dictate that it should be worth more than that because their service or, or business or company is adding extra value on top of the underlying ether value that's intrinsic. So um, that's my thought. That's I think why ICOs are doing so well why people are going nuts over them and they're selling out in like minutes um so i'm gonna um i'm gonna have to sit down and, and start uh working on more and more of these and stuff so maybe i'll just uh you know i hate to cash out the ether that i have banked but man i see that as the way to go i guess i don't know i i I really don't know. So um, now that Ether's worth more, it seems like you're getting more tokens in exchange for Ether now than you used to. So I got 1,000 Swarm for 10 Ether, and I think Batcoin was 6,400 Bat for one Ether. So the exchange rate is much better. Um, but um, I don't know, guys. It, this is so much fun. This is like becoming an addiction. And I was just like, man, that's life-changing money to me. Ten thousand or more dollars worth of crypto. Um, like I said, I keep saying it. That's not all of the money that I had in it. I've cashed out a bunch over the over the last year. So it's it's just phenomenal. It's just amazing. So I think. Um, I think what uh, I, I think this is going to be lead to some really good things, really good opportunities and stuff. You know, like money. Never, I've never been a fan of money. I don't like money. I don't like the concept or the value of money. Um, but you got to pay to play the game, and without money, you uh, you're at the mercy of a lot of various people and predators and stuff. You know. Um, Right now, I could not even get approved for a house loan if I wanted to, mainly because of my um, foreclosure that I went through with the divorce and all that. Um, and it's not even really, I don't even think my credit's bad anymore. I think it's just uh, that black, a black mark on my record. And um, I don't like that. I don't like that feeling like there's, n there's nothing I can do. The only alternative is to like rent. Or something so um, I like the new opportunities that this crypto stuff can can lend me 
um, as my portfolio continues to grow, as I learn more, my knowledge expands, all that. And what's going to happen is I'm, I'm, I'm thinking that once I get up to a comfortable amount and I'm able to make, um, I don't want to say a set amount or whatever per week or month or whatever, but once I'm like able to generate um, income at will, I might start taking some draws, like tapping some of my portfolio, um, either for like a car payment or something. And I was thinking about, it, man, if I can get a couple ICOs or something to hit, I could buy a car with cash. That's how life changing this is, and that's that's amazing to me. Um, so that's kind of kind of where my thought process is. I mean, I don't know. I, I need to look back at my screenshots, but I don't even think my portfolio was worth five thousand dollars like three weeks ago or a month ago. So sky's the limit to the moon. Okay, I got my buddy. I missed him. Who taught you this? Mom. Awesome. I like my X under four. Good job, Grant. I like it. You can do both of them? Mm -hmm. Cool. Alright, can you take them off though, or no? Is it permanent? Is it hard to get off? said permanent. Permanent, yeah. Can you get them off, or no? Yeah. Awesome. Good job, Grant. Oh man, we're going to have to bring those shoes so we can show Grandma and Grandpa. They're going to be excited. Where are they? They're at Lake Carroll. Do you want to go there tomorrow? Yay. Do you? Yeah? Alright. Okay, did you see what I got you to eat? Yeah, I think so. Oh. Alright. 